hello guys welcome to my channel so today we are cooking we are cooking Ghana's most famous dawa dawa jollof you can't wait to see how this turn out let's get into it We have our ingredients, everything we will need for the jollof. Now, first things first, we heat up some oil in our trusty pot. Once it is nice and hot, we toss in our chopped onions and give them a stir. Then we add our tomato paste into the frying onions. We then add a little water to help us stir well, make sure it mix very well with our oil. We add our powdered pepper, stir for a while. We add our seasoning cube, stir for a while make sure they are mixed up and at this point we add a little water we gently place some sardine fish into the pot followed with a little water and then allow it to come to a boil stage we add a lot of water to make sure the balls well this is where we add the almighty ingredient the almighty dawa dawa you should be smelling this thing right now guys so we cover it make sure the balls well so the dawa dawa spreads where we add a lot of water into the stew add our salt to taste and then we cover it allow it to boil for some time as you can see this is boiling water, water so we add our washed local rice we are using the local rice to make this our dawa jollof so we wash it very well you know how local rice can be a lot of stones and other things so we wash stir make sure it doesn't stick under and then we cover it for a while jollof can be very tricky guys so once every two minutes i come back to stir to make sure it's not stuck to the pot last minute thoughts i thought of adding spaghetti into my jollof it wasn't something i planned to do but i had some leftover spag and i'm like okay let me put them inside at this point of the food i wanted to give up because i felt like damn i have this waste in my mom but then i had vim so i covered it for a while and then came It was okay but it was still hard so i added a little water stirred for a while and then i did a technique my big sister taught me so you pick one of your neat napkins and then you cover the food with it if you have a is it foil paper or soil paper whatever you add you cover your food and then guys i realized it was working so This part, the water was done, but my rice was still hard, and so I, had, I added a little water again, and then I covered it for I think the last time. <laughs> so this is. 
the last part and damn my rice was rising the dawa dawa was dawa dawa in and everything simmer the aroma fills the entire balcony and I couldn't wait to taste my dawa dawa jelly yeah so this is my dawa dawa jelly love mm, I like it <laughs>